Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I decided to just film a Q&A um, since I did have you guys ask me questions on my social media. Um, and plus, it would be a great icebreaker for my channel. So the first question is, do I have any summer plans? Yes, I did. Um, I don't anymore. But if this quarantine is over with, then I plan on doing a lot. Um, I want to, I mean, nothing big, but I want to take Ethan to the zoo for the first time. I want to have a birthday party for him since he'll be one in July. I want to go to my parents and go in the pool, like stuff like that. But if the quarantine isn't over, then no, I do not have any summer plans. Um, the next question, do I want more kids? And if so, how many? Yes, I want more kids. I want at least two more and I think I'll be happy with that. Was Ethan planned? Yes, he was. Between him and Echo, I swear to you, my house is so loud. They make the most noise ever. And he like sits by the gate and like bangs on it and makes noise. If you guys hear noise, that's what it is. Um, so yes, Ethan was planned. Um, Perks of being a stay-at-home mom and disadvantages. Um, the perks, definitely being able to spend so much time with him. I love waking up and just being able to just spend time with him all day and soak up all the love all to myself. And the disadvantages would be feeling like you're putting in enough. When you are not working and your significant other or the person that you're with is working, it's hard to feel like you are doing enough seeing that you are financially dependent on them. But besides that, I think that's really the only disadvantage. A big disadvantage, but that's the only disadvantage. Do I have any pet peeves? Yes, I think my biggest pet peeve is when I am talking to someone and they cut me off. Um, anyone that knows me knows that. If I'm talking to you and I'm telling you a story and you like stop to check your phone or like you talk to somebody else, or you talk over me, it just aggravates me, I probably would just stop talking to you after a couple times of asking if you're listening, but that's just me. Do I believe in ghosts? If so, why? Yes, I believe in ghosts. I don't have any like crazy, like paranormal uh, encounters that I could tell you guys about, but I believe in ghosts because when I was little, my grandma used to tell me so many stories about like things that have happened to her, like these crazy stories. Um, so that's just how I grew up. I've just always believed in them. What am I most grateful for? Definitely my apartment and how far I've come and Justin um, and my family, obviously, but um, definitely like what I have now. So the next question is, what is my biggest accomplishment? My biggest accomplishment would be graduating high school and moving out on my own. Um, it took me a lot it took a lot for me to graduate um do i have any regrets in life no i do not i don't think i do yeah no what is my biggest flaw my biggest flaw would be definitely caring too much what people think i think that's like the worst thing about me um and my lips because i don't have any but whatever what is the first thing I do when I wake up is, the first thing I do is check my phone. Um, I don't know anybody that does it different, but yeah. Even if Ethan's screaming, I always check my phone. Even if it's just to quickly check the time, first thing I do. How am I surviving being stuck home? I'm not. Um, yeah, I'm definitely not surviving between Ethan, Echo, and the neighbors across the hall, I'm gonna lose my mind. Um, no. Um, it's definitely hard being stuck home because, I mean, what could you do besides walk outside? Um, and you can't do much with a nine month old. If I can have any pet, what would it be? If I can have any pet, it would be a ferret. Nothing, like I don't have this like exotic animal, um, but if I can have any pet, it would be a ferret. That's why I don't I don't have any reason. I just love them. I think they're so cute and so smart and I just love like watching them like hide stuff. And Justin won't let me get one, so that's the only reason why I won't have one. So you guys can all message him and yell at him for not letting me have a ferret. If I can snap my fingers, what would my dream job be? Um definitely a labor and delivery nurse. That's what I wanted to do my whole life. Um it just for some reason never worked out that way for me. 
Um, I did go to school to become an LPN and that didn't work. I absolutely hated it. I don't have any reason, I don't think, why I hated it. Um, if you went to Porter and Chester, you kind of understand where I'm coming from. And the last question is, what is the best thing about being a mom? Literally everything. Um, if someone says, like, I think I'm gonna, I wanna have kids, I would say, go ahead and do it. Like, not even kidding, it's the best thing in the world. So that is all my questions. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And you guys can message Justin and yell at him and tell him to give me a ferret or let me get a ferret. I will leave his name for instagram right down here so when he gets a million dms he'll be very happy um just say hey i think you should at least get a ferret because she really wants one and she deserves it and yeah so please remember to just subscribe to my channel because i would love to have you and i'll see you guys next time bye today's video telling me it oh they're they smell <laughs> like they're literally fine but he won't let me get one but if my nose is so itchy because i have makeup on oh my god i don't have any but whatever um like literally <laughs> what are my summer plans if the cue it best thing about being a mom hmm no just kidding um are you making music